Okay, everyone, we're going to be doing a talk a little bit about the older HD Wave with screen inverters and what we have to do to kind of wake them up and have everything going. First of all, we always want to make sure the DC is on. And before we pair, we want to make sure the toggle switch is off. So we're going to go ahead and wake up the inverter by going ahead and putting our finger on the screen. This will wake up the inverter if you want to scroll through the items in here. You'll just hit... This allows you to kind of scroll through and see what's going on, whether the Zigbee's hooked up, you know, all the cells saying that the cell is in good shape. If we need to go back, we just hit one. Show cells all good mobile. We're uh, T-Mobile, Signal, all those important things you might need to ask. Country codes, modular power. And sometimes you, you can see I kind of have to push a little hard to get them to go through. Tells you the last one was, oh, whoops, was just the, uh, the day, month, year, and total production of the system, which is kind of, this one's brand new. We just installed this. So kind of keep that in mind. Um, next one is going to be your optimizer status. And this is kind of your main screen here. So, I'm going to go back one. This will kind of give you all your temps, how many optimizers are on site, how everything's going. Now, we're going to show you how to perform a uh, pairing. So, let's say you've added more panels to it, or you've added some optimizers and want to make sure you pair them after a pair. We're going to go ahead and hold down the OK button. It's going to ask you to hold it down for four seconds, and then it's going to go ahead and ask you it's going to say pairing initialized go ahead and turn on the system in a second it will ask you to do that as soon as it does ask you to turn on the system we're actually not going to do that <laughs> so it actually goes back and it will tell us the pairings the pairing initialized uh, and pairing failed on this one as soon as it um, wants us to sit here. So it's going to take a second. These sometimes do take a quite a little while. You'll say pairing initialized, initializing, switch system on. We're not going to. So we're going to see if we can get the back out of this guy. And it will eventually tell us that we have failed to pair. Pairing has failed. Now if it did go through, uh, it would we would sit there and as soon as we said it said turn on system what it's asking us to do is turn the toggle switch right here into the on position it's going to go back into our standard position here and tell us that we don't have any of the um and like i said every time you run your hand over something it, it will fire up here so what it's saying right now is we have sok meaning that we have communication with the with the app there's no production right now because the we've just shut down the optimizers the voltage here is of the street 15 volts is what's coming out of the panels um, right now in safe mode what we're going to do to get in here to uh, actually find so if we turn on the system here it'll try to start firing itself back up again that uh, we do by just turning on the toggle switch right here we're going to come over here and we're going to go into our menu, which is a little harder to get to. So we're going to go ahead and hold down the OK button. It will, As long as you're on, it will almost go directly to this. And then you're going to hit one, two, three, which is the up, down, OK. And we're going to do that three times. And then one, two two this will take us into our country codes communication codes all this kind of stuff here we're going to want to go ahead and go down and you can hear the system just kicked on we're going to go in here to communications communications just has it so we have it all set up here to where if we needed to change the um the server which right now it's set to sell because we have a sell card up here and then from there, we can go ahead and come out here to um, your information pages here. 
So maintenance information, information will get us into if there's any air logs here. Go ahead and hit OK. We can go down to our air logs, and again, we just hit OK for that, and then come all the way back out. So nothing real severe, but that's kind of how you navigate the system here. If you guys have any questions, please leave in the bottom. We'll talk to you later.